I'm working with the Bernina 790 and a Mac computer to download EXP or DST formatted designs for embroidery, there's a couple things you need to know. Number one, make sure you're using a one gig stick or a Bernina USB stick. So if you can't find a stick that's working for you, keep searching and if you can't find one, visit your local Bernina retailer and they will have one available to you. Once you put the stick in the machine, select the USB symbol at the top and if you have created folders, they will come up first. This is the next project I'm working on and the first thing I notice is that I get these pink squiggly lines in my design. So there's just something about a way a Mac puts a design on the machine uh, is that you need to scroll to the second half of the designs. So right now I have 16 pages. This is a big collection. So the first eight pages of designs are non-existent. You'll see when I get to the designs, they will show up as actual designs. So if I'm looking for my monograms that I'll be using, they are ready to select. The designs that have that squiggly line are not. There's nothing wrong with your computer. There's nothing wrong with your machine. It's just the way that a Mac puts the information on a USB stick that this machine will recognize and actually show up first before the designs. Now, if you are working with a PC computer and Windows, you do not have this issue. This will not interfere with anything you're doing. You just need to make sure you're using a one gig stick and also the EXP or DST format of the designs. And that's something that's available for, from just about any of your embroidery companies that you'll be purchasing designs from downloading designs from or buying them on CDs.